Samaria. What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into a story time of how I found out my baby daddy was cheating on me while I was pregnant. Let's get it. I talk about my baby daddy like that, but I just seen a post that triggered me. He said, posting your name when you know you was talking to mom is crazy. Ooh. And that led me to think about the demise between me and Todd and dad. Oh, and this is for Keisha. Her name not really Keisha, but when I find out, when I find out, oh, I'm coming. I found out I was pregnant with my son Mother's Day of 2021. At the time, I was 19 years old. My natural 19-year-old mind, I was popping. I was making money like I had the racks at the time. I tell him in a follow-up statement after we both find out together is I'm getting an abortion. He started doing all this hooting and hollering like, no, I keep it. But at the time, we wasn't together when I conceived my son. Like, you know how you break up with somebody, but y'all still like doing an on and off thing? We wasn't together, but we were still around each other. And clearly, we were still, you know. Doing it. Uh -huh. I told him, like, yeah, I'm about to get an abortion. He begged me not to get an abortion. I said, the only way I won't get an abortion is if we about to work out what we got going on and be a family. Because I'm not about to be nobody's baby mama. Uh -huh. He's like, okay, that's fine with me. So, like, this is, like, around May. So, May and June, it's going good. July, he start acting weird as f on my mama. And July is also my birthday month. So, it's like, you picking the wrong month time to act weird now around this time i'm threatening him like if you keep doing this i'm getting an abortion because i still we had told both of our families but i also still had enough time to get an abortion i probably was like four months but he knew that i wasn't gonna do that because i was only gonna do the one with the pill i had ran out of time for the pill one so basically the other option was to have the baby sucked out of me i felt like that would be too traumatic for me this is where I start adding up two and two on the weird shit he was doing. One day he was over at my house and I had an Apple TV and his uh, iCloud was on the Apple TV because he got it for me. So I go to the pictures on his Apple TV and I see him and a girl. Now the picture with him and a girl. You know, I hate it for you heteros. And I'm saying that because, you know, back in the days when I was backsliding in Cleveland. I was allergic to uh, latex. I, well, hell, I am allergic to latex. Uh, but thank God I don't need it anymore. <laughs> but anyhow, um, it's like, who want to do it with a glove? Don't nobody want to do that. So here you are thinking, all right, I'm just about to come right quick. And everything will be good. But have y'all noticed you straight people, when y'all do it, Y'all are really risking y'all lives and stuff. And I mean, like, risking potentially having a child for the rest of your life. That's what it felt like, a glove, Maya. Just a whole bunch of shit on something that you ain't even feeling what's really going on. And if I was y'all, I would hate gloves too, quite frankly. Gloves was never necessarily my thing, but that's another reason why I don't have to worry about those anymore. But, oh my God, before y'all do it, are y'all ever like, oh my God, I could potentially get pregnant, but I don't want to wear a glove. Also, I like to feel it and uh, he probably don't know what he's doing anyway. He gonna come at me. Do y'all ever think that? <laughs> I'm just wondering what y'all think in the, in the, in the, um, 20th century these days. Does it come to your mind? That would just ugh, bother me. But anyhow. The girl wasn't like incriminating <laughs> and I have a lot of male friends. So I wasn't like automatically on tip. I'm like, who is this? He like this, such and such. That's been my dog since high school, whatever, whatever. And he was in a car with her with a whole bunch of money. But they wasn't like hugging, kissing, none of that. It was just them in the car and him pregnant was, right now. Done. G, she was in the hmm. passenger seat and he was in the driver's seat. And he had told me like her name. So I'm like, okay, that was the first red flag. Now the second red flag came. I went over to his house one day, and on the Hulu profile, it had his normal profile that I always see. It didn't have a profile that said MK. So I'm like, who is MK? And he like, now mind hmm. you, a couple weeks before that, he had already told me. Like her name when I seen the picture on the little thing. I feel you, Stone. But he said that that stood for Mike, which was his homeboy. I'm like, what grown ass 
man with kids called they self they name Mike and they call themselves MK. That don't make no sense. But I just let it rock. Oh. Well, that escalated quickly. Okay. Mm -hmm. But I was on to him at this point. So boom, a couple days later, I let the sh sizzle out or whatever. Sizzle. And I'm thinking he thought I forgot. So I go over to his house when I know he not home because he lived with his mama. So I go over there. She let me in. And then he Damn come home. Mamas. And he see me and he surprised. But at this point, by the time he get home, it's like 11, 30, 12 o'clock at night. And he was also surprised because he told me he was at home. But I was at his house and he ah. wasn't there. So you already started out up. Oh, my God. First thing he do, he get in the shower and then he go get on the game. So when he get on the game, this my chance. He know that I hated when he played the game, but I ain't trip. I said, if you playing the game, I'm about to get on your laptop. Now Wait. the laptop. You been there whole time and wasn't on the laptop? Maybe he had it. Was connected to the phone. Anything that's on the phone is on the laptop. Oh. She needed that phone to be there. Okay. Oh, okay. And this is where he truly no lube. As soon as I said I wanted to touch that laptop, he completely shuts the game down. Because I tell him, like, can I get on your laptop so I can watch a movie? He shuts the game down. And he like, oh, what movie you want to watch? What movie you want to watch? He never wants to watch movies. All he ever wanted to do was play the game. So I said, okay. I know what I got to do. I got to get in that laptop. Because I didn't know the passcode to his phone. I said, I got to get in that laptop. So I played along. I ain't tripped. You know, I could have tripped and been like, why you don't want me to see it? No, I ain't even do all that. I played it cool. Oh, wow. We went on the rest of the night. Buddy, buddy, we watched the movie. All of that. Next morning, I was on him. I got up. He did the same thing. He hopped on the game again. So I'm like, okay, let me see your laptop so I can trade. Now, that's how I made money. So he couldn't tell me no. And I ain't bring my laptop. So I go get his laptop from off the table and I'm like, unlock it. So he unlock it and he like, hold on, I got to see something. So he on the laptop, but I'm standing over him. So whatever he's trying to do or finagle is no doing it or no finagling, baby. You, it, it's nothing. He on top of that, ass. the laptop was about to die. So he wanted me to use the laptop in front of him, but we was laying on the couch and there was no outlets right there. So I had to go to the table, which the table was in the living room and the couch was in the dining room, but the living room and the dining room was connected. It was an apartment, so it wasn't that big. But when I walked to the couch, you can't see what I'm doing on this laptop. I didn't even go to messages first things first. First things first, I went to photos. Mm. First thing I see is, a, is, is two naked people. Ooh. And... One of them naked people wasn't me, Ooh. but one of them was him. Um. Then he get a text message on his phone, the phone and the laptop ding at the same time. Ding, ding, ding. We Ooh. have a winner. He oh, look no. over at me and then he stared dead at his game. I clicked the messages. Now, my heart was already in my ass from the video, but I, I, I kept my It was a video? I I'm, clicked on the messages. I'm thinking it's just pictures. My heart went to my ass. And you knew I was going to go through the phone. You, I mean, you knew I was going to go through the laptop. You knew. You knew. Maybe you didn't Why know. did you even let me do that? I would have took the laptop and broke it. So then. Uh, so then. Wait a minute. Friend, we don't have part three? When did she put this out? Where's part three? You send it again. I ain't got it. Where the hell is part three at? Fra. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Skip it. If you on the video, skip it. Oh. Thank you, for. I tried to. Hold on now. Hold the line. Okay. Breathe and stay calm so that I could see and read as much as I possibly could. I thought y'all, I'm invested. Good. So I got about two minutes into reading. And like I said, he knew. He wasn't dumb. He knew. And I'm the type of person that wear everything on my face. I'm reading. He's saying he love her. They talking about again. All of that. I start having a anxiety attack. So I get up. I'm like. Because <sighs> I'm pissed. I'm like, I really sat here and got pregnant. I'm like five months pregnant at this point. I don't think it's not going back. I mean, I could have, but I was about to do that. I'm like, he like, what's wrong? He knew what was wrong. 
He like, what's wrong? I'm like, you really did this to me? He like, what? He what was making me more mad is that he's playing dumb when he know exactly what the fuck is going on. Do you know everything that's on your phone is on your laptop? You know I've been trying to get to the laptop. Stop playing with me, like, bro. So now I didn't hit him in the shit. I'm like, bro. This is why, this is why you never wanted to come over. This is why you been acting weird and you gave me some burnt ass roast. This is why. So now we going back and forth. We arguing. He like, you went through my stuff. You said that you were trading. You went through my stuff. I said, I don't give a So now his <laughs> mama come out because it's a little apartment. Like that apartment is probably 500 square feet. No mm. cap. She come out her room. What's going on? Your son been cheating on me. Oh, this, I'm pregnant. da 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 da, -da. Now, son, I told you this was going to happen. I told you you had to choose. So you knew this whole f time? Baby, they going to go with that son. Their mama don't give a damn about you. They going to go with that son. Okay, I'll get to you later. Your so mama now, almost you don't give a damn about you. She going to go with your brother. Literally. He was arguing. He trying to tell me like, I don't know if I said this already, but he basically trying to tell me like, they ain't do it. He just got the or whatever i'm like i'm trying to like believe it because i guess that make it a little more bearable but of course i knew he was lying but it's like he tried to spare my feelings with the lie so since i couldn't control myself long enough to do the real digging like maybe get her number Hold on, before she even finished you know these these brothers not brothers these um sons bring the mamas in it because they always walking up through the living room I always got to walk a shame through the living room Hey, my, this Keisha. Hey, my, this Ashley. Hey, my, this is um, whoever. You know what I'm saying? Girl. <laughs> or maybe get her Instagram to go to. Oh, wait. You can't do Instagram on laptop. So, Facebook to see anything. I kind of just flipped too early. So, now I don't got no information. So, I'm going off. I'm going crazy. I'm going crazy. Eventually, I storm out and I leave. When I leave, now I got to figure out what. It's going on. Who is this person? Because you want to tell me y'all ain't been around like that? You're lying. And I'm about to get the truth. So I go on his Facebook and I'm scrolling. Now remember, remember in, in part one, I told y'all that he had a Hulu account on his Hulu that said MK? Booyah! 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 <laughs> that was also her name in his phone with like a heart. I go scrolling on his Facebook, right? Scrolling on his Facebook. And you know how on Facebook somebody make a post and you don't you, you like, basically, you you press share and then you type something at the top. So she had just got a new apartment, I guess. So he was like, proud of you. He didn't say gang, but he was like, proud of you mamas or proud of you. Not nothing too incriminating, but it was still like, yeah, y'all f*** with each other. Mamas is incriminating. And her name on there had an M and had a K. I said, I f*** gotcha. Mind you, also, me and him wasn't... Sean Don, Glow dropped a song with uh, Sexy Red. Did you know that? Facebook friends. I think we had, like, stop being... No, I don't think we was ever Facebook friends, actually. So, boom, I messaged her on Facebook, and I also messaged her on Instagram. I messaged her on Facebook and on Instagram because she wasn't moving fast enough on Facebook, and I'm like, who the fuck is on Facebook? So, I'm like, let's go to Instagram but she ended up messaging first back on Facebook. I Jamie, think. I would tell my son, don't bring that little girl around me and have that other little girl around me. I'm going to tell. Uh-uh, you ain't putting me in that. And then they be looking at me like I'm crazy. No. No. You better you better choose uh, uh, your pick your poison. Got the screenshot to this day. I basically had a little paragraph typed up. I was like, um, do you mess with Ariante? Because he's saying that y'all never did it. And I just want to know because me and him is doing it and like we about to have a baby. And if he doing it like with two people, like it ain't no beef with you or nothing like that. I'm just trying to figure out what's going on for me and my child's sake or whatever. So she said, you unsent the message before I could read it all. How do you know? I, I, I said, because I went through his phone with a computer when this morning. You gonna send a message before I could read it. It, uh, it all, ma'am. How do you even know I'm talking to him because I went through his phone with a computer when? This morning, you was with him this morning when he texted you and said he was asleep. Yeah, last night and this morning. <laughs> you was with him this morning. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, well, Not yeah. reaching out. Oh, you talking about Shawty. Okay, okay. I thought you were yeah, talking I was about like, I said, Like I said, I don't want to room what y'all got going on. I just want to know 
if y'all are doing it so I can go to the doctor. She said, yes, we do. And you pregnant? Okay, cool. Thanks. I lost my shit when she said, I'm with him right now. I lost it. I lost it. I lost it. But obviously to her, like, I didn't tell her that. But, like, on the inside, I was losing it. You just got caught and you already with the... Okay. I stormed off. You ain't even come check on me. See if I was good. You straight went with the other one. Okay. Now, y'all remember how I said in the beginning, I was like, what even triggered me to start this whole story time was the fact of I seen a post that said, you posting your name thinking you safe. You was with mine. Okay. Let's, 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 let's flip. Let's, let's, let's switch gears and, and get over to that side. Oh. We got a part four, y'all. Where's the part four at? Ah, thank you, Casita. You concede. You got a One reason. I hate is a bitch that try to get funny with me. So remember how I told y'all I had DM her on Instagram and on Facebook because I felt like Instagram would be easier because I'm not a Facebook user, but she apparently was a Facebook user because she responded on Facebook first. So I guess she had seen that after she said, you don't got to stalk my page. You can keep your baby daddy mamas. I said, girl, nobody's stalking you nor being rude to you. So you keep your hood to yourself <laughs> this is why i gotta come back with a vengeance because back then you feel me i wasn't real quick on my feet with the comebacks and this is why the bitch felt like she could continue to try me of course she continued to oh my God. mess with him no even after she talking about you keep your baby daddy that was a piece of shit. that was some bullshit. she continued to fuck with him and i was all the way in atlanta at school so he was in detroit i was in atlanta at school so I didn't really see him that much. Yeah, I still talked to him, but I didn't barely even see him. One day, I'm watching her story and listen. If I'm gonna watch her story, I'm gonna watch that shit off my real page. Oh. Eventually, she ended up blocking me, but I'm watching her story. I see somebody say, what baby girl say one more time? Hey, I'm not trying to ruin things. These bitches was mumbling and cackling and talking about me. These were mumbling and cackling and talking about me. Okay. See, when I was, like, before this, this was my villain story because, like, before this, I was very naive. I thought everything was girl power. I thought that we could be, I always thought if this situation was to ever occur with me, me and the other girl was going to team up and make that feel like a piece of shit. But I've been in this situation three times. Three friends? That never happened. That never happened. And I always look like the idiot in it as well. At that moment right there. I made a personal vow to myself. I don't give a fuck if my son is 10. Baby, if I happen to wake up one day and got that on my mind, and you feel me do some snooping around, and I see, uh-oh, such and such got a boyfriend now. You feel me? I'm going to do something. Huh? Yeah, um, me and him, we obviously broke up. We were still like, when I did come back to Detroit, we was like around each other. But then once I had Thailand, it was pretty much all over. Like, once I found out that the, the, the dudes were still f***ing me after I had a baby, it was over. It was over. It was over. I resented him so much because you made me have a baby with you when you basically had another girlfriend. And he had multiple other girlfriends, but this was, like, the most prevalent one. He, he She was at his mom's house all the time. He bought her a dog, like, all type of little mm. Well, he claimed he didn't buy her the dog. He claimed that. She bought herself a dog. She just gave him the money, and he went to go pick the dog up. But once I had Thailand, um, he wanted to be back together. Um, it just didn't work. And then I got with my psychopathic ex. Ah! Oh. So, yeah. Three times, friend? Three. <clears throat> Mm -mm. Uh-uh. Oh, uh-uh. <laughs> you the problem. <laughs> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I am done with this video. Oh, my God. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Yeah.